Hey, it's Bragg here from Get With A Game with a Vegemite Toast Profile. Uh, look, there's nothing more to say here. You know what's going on. Let's get right into it. Uh, so, for the ingredients of said toast, you need a slice of bread. If you're feeling a bit more peckish, this is a, a bigger meal you want. Maybe two slices of bread. Uh, a plate, uh, crumbs everywhere, don't want that. Now, all important, Vegemite, uh, the staple of this recipe slash deck profile. Uh, if you're up for it, some margarine, and uh, I take a peanut butter, we'll get, a bit, we'll get into that later, and also a knife. This is probably my favorite Vegemite knife, I always go to it in the morning. I'm being serious. So, here's the combo. We have one slice in the toaster, two slices in the toaster, in. Uh, this is on, a, on the, the four setting of this one. It's the default setting of when someone unplugs and replugs back in the toaster because they want to plug in an air fryer or a kettle or another air fryer or oh, what's that thing called that they use? The rice cooker. Yeah, this, this toaster always gets unplugged. Eh, what do you do? So what you're looking for is a bit, bit fluffy, not too overdone, eh, but too fluffy we might run into some problems. So we're going to see how the rest of this combo goes just by looking at the toast. We're just looking. We're waiting. Yeah, I've been actually eating cereal a bit more lately, so I, I'm a bit out of my element with this. I hope I don't stuff it up. That's a loud bang. When I'm making my toast uh, during the heating process, now that's a bit. Now this is really fluffy, not too uh, overdone. So I know how I'm going to do. Like I'm going to play this because I'm actually in the mood for a bit of fluffy toast at the moment. Uh, there's the other slice. Uh, not integral. Not integral. So there are people out there that insist on margarine uh, butter, whatever this is. This is a. Uh, this says it's. This doesn't say if it's even margarine. This is just a spread. Uh, oil spread. Uh, people will insist that you need this for Vegemite. Look, if you want it to taste better and smoother, sure. I'm not about that. I go raw and hard with pure Vegemite goodness. Now, this is a fresh pack of Vegemite. No, it's not. Someone's already been into it and somehow resealed it. Wild. I hope there isn't a needle in this. Now, this is a, probably a bit too much. So, we're going to go down to maybe that much. You can wipe it back in. Maybe you can sneak it on a couple of ulcers you got really helps out. So, four. You don't want to go too hard on it because you'll stab into it and ruin the integrity of the toast. So you want to go, kind of go light in the middle, spread it out. Yeah, that's the stuff. That's the stuff. Out to here. We've got a little bit more on the knife to try and get to that corner. I've messed it up and got the uh, got some on the crust, but that will help with the crust. I like eating the crust too. Um, Personal preference. I won't really judge you for that. Unlike with the whatever this is. There we go. So there is Vegemite on toast. Uh, I'm not sure if I'm going to eat it now. No, we'll, we'll put this back. So if you're feeling hardcore, you can go for two. You can make it a sandwich, or you can have a peanut butter chaser just to even out the palate and get back to even. And also. You don't even need to wash the knife. You can just go like with that because the peanut butter overpowers the veggie much. Pro strat. I think I heard a laugh. Now I've gone too heavy in on this piece of toast and it has suffered damage. Unbelievable. Shouldn't have gone that hard. And as you can see, there's the knife. All well and good. You can rinse the knife in between if you want or, you know, you can just put it in the dishwasher if you're not going to go with either slice. Now, that was the veggie mite. Toast profile from me, Bragg, on Cow Whip again. Oh yeah, fuck yeah, that's pretty good. That's pretty good. That's pretty good sloth of toast. Yeah. <laughs> no matter.